we have just crossed uh, the road border, the uh, border. You can see Changu, the Chinese uh, area. Andy making stupid comments. <laughs> <laughs> this is how Andy looks on the first day of the trek. Take a full view shot of the close up and our colleagues on the trek. This is our friends on the trek. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Hello. Hi. And the This is the Jeep right. we are traveling and this is a truck which is messing up everything. <laughs> We can uh, this is, uh, cigarette in your hand. Mohan and uh, Stefan together. Stefan is smoking a cigarette. I'm still not tempted. Yeah, so far so good. It's uh, day two, <laughs> day, day three. <laughs> and Stefan has been chain smoking continuously and so far it has ensured that he has not smoked even a puff. So, so far so good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I smoke your cigarette. And this is the figure from which we are coming. Going towards Neelam. Kerry, are you all right? I, I try my best. <laughs> so let me take a shot of you also. Huh? Yeah, this is Kerry, who is also on our trip. It's not my best day today. Not her best day today, but we'll shoot her when she feels a lot more better. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Second day at Nalam, at the Matasu. BNB is Mount Andy. This is Spukhau. Well, you need a flash in there. This is a cave where uh, somebody used to meditate here uh, uh, as it is 15 years ago. 
Is a part of Chakra Sambhava. This is the entrance to the cave. Andy trying to get into the cave. This is the fourth day of acclimatization uh, at Nylum. We are going to a lake which is uh, 500 meters uh, above Nylum. Yesterday we covered uh, 200 meters up and uh, today it is uh, 500 meters. And they say if you can do this and one can do uh, Kura successfully. That is Andy showing off how strong he is. Now, in fact, for you it looks everything easy. Like a dog. You make this too far. I make this too far here. <laughs> you can see how much uh, I, will, I am very one sided. Okay, because it's one sided. <laughs> also, drink some water there. Well, what, what is this lake called, Roger? Daracho. Daracho. Buttermilk Lake. Can you tell me the significance of this? This is when Rebecca came from Kailash, he took ice from Mount Kailash and here. He rinsed this towel because the ice was used up for drinking, and then this day uh, lake appeared. Okay. So it's actually water from Mount Kailash. So to say.